Hey there, Bob from Oregon's Constant Garden. Welcome to the OCG fam. Show to you, my YouTube buddies, what's going on? Let me know in the comments. We'll talk about it after the show right now. Let's just get into the show. Last couple days, for a while now, we've been talking about feeding hard in bloom, pushing, pushing, pushing. But today we're going to turn it on its head. What if you have a plant that's just a little finicky? Uh, it just doesn't want to eat that much food. You're struggling with that. You want to give it full nutrition, but you can't just pour it on because the plant doesn't like that. This clip, I think, addresses that in a way that you may not have thought of and may be interesting to you. I'd like you to watch it. I'll talk to you. Trademark says, I'm using nine bottles, so I would like to hear you talk about how to feed all these different things with a light feeder. Oh, so like he's, he's, he's not giving the plant a lot of food, but he's got nine different things he wants to give it. Is there any difference than just a quarter teaspoon instead of half a teaspoon, or is it, you know, I mean, yes. I, I honestly would keep my base nutrients you know, my Gaia, my Medusa, my yeah. Zeus, and my Herc, uh -huh. all pretty much at the base level. Uh -huh. And I would create a base level feeding uh -huh. schedule in uh -huh. a sense. But I would take the remaining of these products that I want out of, let's so say you have nine total, you could use four consistently and religiously. Uh -huh. The other five, you can split those up and either give them two with this feed on this day and the other three on this feed on that day. Some people will go base food on one day, additives on the next day, so they're going back and forth. So they're not going all of nine products into one gallon, trying to keep uh, okay. it under a thousand okay. parts per million because yeah, okay. you'd be doing trace amounts. Uh -huh. Instead, you kind of set your PPM of, all right, in veg, I'm going to max out at 800 parts per million. So I'm going to use, today I'm going to use Medusa, Gaia, Zeus, and Herc, and I'm going to need it to 800 parts per million. Uh -huh. And this isn't for everybody's feeding schedule. Sure, this is for life this, feeder, yeah. this individual. Yeah. Uh -huh. So I'm going to feed it at 800. Uh -huh. And now that's on Monday. So on Wednesday, I'm going to go in with my Demeters, my Athenas, my Morpheus, and my Circes, and I'm going to give them that at 800 uh -huh. parts per million. And kind of go back and forth. So you're getting still two days a week of your base nutrients, two days a week of your additive nutrients. Okay. All together, still getting a full spectrum of the feed throughout the entire week period of time. Okay, what do you think of that? Informative? Entertaining? Helpful? Let me know in the comments. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. It's the OCG Fam Show.